وَلَقَدْ آتَيْنَا مُوسَى الْكِتَابَ وَقَفَّيْنَا مِنْ بَعْدِهِ بِالرُّسُلِ And verily, we gave to Moses the book, that is Torah, وَقَفَّيْنَا مِنْ بَعْدِهِ بِالرُّسُلِ and we, and we followed him up with a succession of messengers, prophets after prophets, a chain, continuous chain of prophets after Moses till Jesus. For 1400 long years, this chain of prophethood never broke. There's a hadith in Sahih al-Bukhari. The prophet says, كُلَّمَا هَلَكَ نَبِيٌّ خَلَفَهُ نَبِيٌّ كَانَتْ بَنُوا إِسْرَائِيلِ تَسْخُوزَهُمُ الْأَنْبِيَاءِ كُلَّمَا هَلَكَ نَبِيٌّ خَلَفَهُ نَبِيٌّ the community affairs and the politics, political affairs of Bani Israel were, hands, were in the hands of the prophets. Whenever a prophet died, another prophet was the caliph. He took his place. So continuous change. And now the last, end of the chain. And we gave to Jesus, to Isa, son of Mary, Maryam. Alayhim as-salatu was salam al-bayyinat, clear signs, clear proofs. And here it means the miracles, the biggest miracles, you know, which can be seen through these senses. They were given to Hazrat al-Masih alayhi salatu was salam. Bayyadnahu biruhi al-Qudus, and we supported him and helped him with the pure spirit and ruh al-Qudus. And it means Hazrat al-Jibrail alayhi salatu was salam. So what? Whenever there came a Rasul, there came a Prophet with something that you didn't like, your souls didn't approve, with some teaching which was not liked by you, you became arrogant, you didn't accept. Some of them, some of those prophets, you only belied them, you only disbelieved them. But And some of them you have been killing and murdering. As you know, they murdered Hazrat Yahya alayhi salatu was salam, John the Baptist, the cry from the wilderness according to the Bible. Hazrat Yahya alayhi salam, and he was, he was killed by the Jew king of that time. And the Jews, they decreed that Jesus must be hanged, crucified. Although it's a different story, what Allah Ta'ala did with him, with him. But they at least tried to do the same. They killed in the same manner, Hazrat Zakriya alayhi salatu was salam. For fariqan kazzabtun wa fariqan taqtulun. And I told you there is a long charge sheet against our Jews, against this former Muslim Ummah. As a result of which they were deposed from that position, high position. وَقَالُوا قُلُوبُنَا غُلْفِ And they said, actually, in mocking at the Muslims and Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, قُلُوبُنَا غُلْفِ Our hearts are wrapped up. Our hearts are secure. What did they mean by this? Well, your preaching will have no effect on us. Don't think you can convince us. Keep your preaching with you. It's not going to affect our hearts. Our hearts are fortified. You know, they are secure. Kulubana wolf. Now, what are the comments by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala? Ballanahumullahu bi kufrain. Actually, the condition is that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has cursed them. They are under the curse and lana of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Bi kufrain. Due to their disbelieving. And it is correct. That a very few among them will come to believe and join the, this Ummah of Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. وَلَمَّا جَاءُمْ كِتَابُ مِنْ عِنْدِ اللَّهِ And when a book came to them from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Now although this is a generalized word, it can mean Quran also. It can mean Injil also. Whenever a book came to them. But you know most of the Mufassirin think that here Quran is being mentioned. When a book from Allah has come to them, and it is confirming that which is with them. It is accepting the Torah was also book of Allah, which he gave to Moses. And they 
and they were at the before that time they were invoking allah's blessings that that last prophet now should be sent so that with his help we can defeat our enemies we can defeat the disbelievers and the ladina kafar because they they had this tradition in their books that when the last prophet would come then you know his deen will be supreme over all the other religions so they were waiting and they used to say to the people of aws and khadraj in madina that presently you can defeat us but you know when that prophet comes we shall fight you being his companions with his help we shall defeat you but when that prophet came sallallahu alaihi wasallam falamma jaahum ma arafu when came, when he came to them whom he who they recognized that he is the prophet for whom we were waiting he is that prophet ma arafu kafar but they disbelieved him they rejected him they refused to believe in him falanatullah ala alkafirin again the same comments from allah subhanahu wa taala so there there is curse of allah subhanahu wa taala on these disbelievers